So we're driving up to Lodi, and, and on the way up, it popped in my head. I said, how about Rescue Dog Wines? And she immediately said, no. no. <laughs> I'm Blair Lott. And I'm Laura Lott. And together, we're Rescue Dog Wines. So we started Rescue Dog Wines kind of accidentally, or, or even as a hobby. Blair decided that he wanted to move to the country, and I'm a little more of a city girl, um, but we made a bargain that, that if we moved to the country and Blair could do his farming and he could grow some grapes, that I got to rescue dogs. So Laura asked me, you know, once I came up with the idea of Rescue Dog Wines, what percentage will we actually donate? And I thought about it, I said, well, if we're gonna do this seriously, let's make it 50%. And, and that was the clincher, and Laura said, <laughs> That, that I can do that. <laughs> the beginning of our journey with rescue dogs really started with my dog Daisy. I would never have thought that I could have gotten that much support and that level of love from an animal. To realize that she had come from a, a shelter, she had been discarded by somebody else, made me realize how many other companion animals are out there in that exact same situation. Rescue Dog Wines really says what it's about. It is about the rescue animals and it's about the wine. And it was important to us again that it, that it be quality wine and that as we're representing rescues that we represent them to the best of our ability. And it is a lot of work. We are, we are still very much a mom and pop organization. We don't have huge marketing budget. So the main way that we get our wine out in front of as many people as we can is we participate in events. So we participate in wine industry events, so the wine festivals that you hear about. We also donate a lot of wine for fundraising. Yeah, really those are our favorite events when we're with animal, you know, animal rescue people and helping them raise money with our wine. And uh, yeah, there's nothing more fun than that. <laughs> I think one of my favorites was when a woman tried our wine, loved it, and then called her husband over and said, hey, you've got to try this, you've got to try this, and this. Said, that's not going to be any good, it has a dog on the label. <laughs> he did take a sip of the wine and really thoroughly enjoyed the wine. It's one of those gratifying things when, when somebody takes the sip and you can see, oh. It all comes together. It put, they put it together, oh, this, this is, this, this is good is wine. wine. And they realize that by enjoying this great wine, they actually can do something great and save a life is a pretty good combination.